And this is how Liverpool start the game. And they are a team, Lee, known for their aggressive high pressing. Well, absolutely. That takes a lot of hard work, a lot of organisation, force the opposition to make early passes. The weakness of it, if you beat the high press, you can get exposed at the back. Different venues give us different commentary vantage points. And the commentary position here at Anfield, Lee, we love it, very high up. Yeah, I've got my binoculars, though, it's quite far away, but you get a brilliant, brilliant view of the players, almost like watching a video game below. And a glance at the Napoli side. It looks like a conventional 4-4-2. A preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield, Really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. I don't think the referee spot the free kick from long range. He didn't miss by much, Lee. No, I thought the ball would be coming into the box, but long range free kick is at a go. Callejon now. Insigne. And a chance for them to notch in front. A goal it is, at long last, they've broken the deadlock. Well, it's been so close this game. Tactics have played a part. Now they're going to have to change the tactics and see what happens. Hit the target, tick, power, tick, goal, tick. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. He's driven in the corner. Great chance with that header, but he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar. This time, he just gets his angles wrong, just past the post. There goes the final whistle, and it is a victory in this group stage match for Napoli. Yeah, it was a good performance. Tight game, entertaining game, back and forth. Test for both sets of players, but one side has come out on top, but only just.